first time I got to see the Bugatti Chiron, I just stay speechless. The collaboration between us and the Bugatti company was quite exciting and uh, to be honest a little bit scary as well because for me it was uh, jumping on something a bit more challenging than usual and a very big project but uh, quite exciting to be to be working on something completely new and uh, pushing my skills. The guys took us there, opened the door and wow what an amazing place. I just I, I couldn't stop staring at the car. There was so many down there and some being prepared, some were finished and wow, just a great experience. So I could see the, the car for real and, and this was a great help for me to develop the project because you, you don't see everything on pictures and there I could actually feel the curves, see how the car actually really look like and, and this was a, a great boost for me to, to recreate the best model ever in technique. To get started on such a big project, I first had to create a sketch model of the Bugatti Chiron out of Lego Technic elements. It was for me to, to see if I could recreate the model with the element that we have today. I can't remember how many models I had to build, how many versions of the Bugatti Chiron I, I created. But uh, yeah, the process was actually split in two phases and I made a lot of exteriors. It turned out to be quite good, so we moved to the next step. It's difficult to say uh, what I'm the most proud of because I think everything looks great on this model today. Everything was a big challenge, but uh, yes, I would say the rear section of the car. It was uh, giving me quite a lot of headaches as well to, to get to shape it so it looks like the, the, real, the real car. To see that actually work at the end is, uh, is quite uh, rewarding. I'm very, very proud today to say that uh, yes, the model is, is there and it's, uh, it's looking good.